Warning, this video contains extremely graphic and disturbing images of Creative Venice clones, which some viewers may find distressing. Discretion is strongly advised. Hi, so Smile Out here. Just a quick review of Dreams by Chris Adams. Now, here's an Aventus clone you don't hear anything about. Dreams by Chris Adams. Chris Adams. Um, that's Dreams with a Z. Presentation's quite nice. It's got this kind of box. It looks quite nice. Problem with this bottle is the sprayer. I mean, you have to get right in, in here to get a decent spray on it. And I, I mean, the couple of sprays that I sprayed out there are, are pretty decent. But um, in general, it can be sometimes it can just spurt out. It's a little bit like um, you know a, a kitten sneezing on your hand or something. It's It's, it's not very good. It's one of the worst sprayers I've come across, actually. The longevity on this one is decent. Six hours. It projects for about an hour. Siage on this is moderate. Not many notes in this. Um, citrus notes. I think bergamot, lemon, vanilla, uh, vetiver, musk, and leather. For me, I'm mostly getting the citruses in the opening. Then you're getting the vetiver and vanilla. And you know what? This is a pretty, pretty good Aventus clone. It doesn't smell cheap. For me, I think it's one of the better um, Aventus clones. It lacks birch. It's not smoky at all, so it's not a dark one. It's more of a kind of a citrusy take on Aventus. The dry down on this is quite similar to a batch of Aventus that I have. I can't remember what the batch is off the top of my head. It's the stage after the kind of birch goes away, and it's kind of, you kind of get that musk, vanilla, just kind of a creamy base notes. So that's kind of what this is. You get that opening kind of citrus with the vetiver. There's no real birch in it. So it's, it's kind of a bit of a woody kind of citrus. And then you get those base notes, the kind of musk, uh, vanilla, kind of creamy base. Leather is a note there, but it doesn't. it's not really a leathery scent. Maybe there is maybe a tiny kind of hint of it. It's not prominent at all. It reminds me a little bit of Avenue by Al Rehab, but without that. Chewly. It reminds me a little bit of Urban Elements Marble by Next. You can get this one pretty cheaply, so you know, give it a try. It's good, but um, as I said, the spare is pretty shit. But other than that, for me, it gets a, gets a thumbs up, so give it a try. All right, that was my review of Dreams by Chris Adams. If you found this video interesting, please give me a like. And if you want to see more of these videos, please subscribe. Thank you.